Hi everybody, here we are again. This is uh, just a quick one, nothing brewing related, apart from the fact that I've got a, a Woodford's Wherry. Very nice. Nice and fruity. But I got this as a Christmas present. Bit of a gadget. It's a Zippo hand warmer. Now it looks very similar to a Zippo lighter, which I have got one from the days we used to partake of a tab or two. Um, it comes with its own fuel can. Well, it's a measuring jug really. So Take it apart, you take the lid off, take the cap off. I'm not going to fill it full, uh, but it will do. There's a 12 hour version, and there's a 6 hour version, and this is the 6 hour version. If you fill it up to the line, I don't know if you can see the line, it'll take two or three good squirts to fill it up to the line that was one squirt it's about halfway that'll do for demonstration purposes not that you'll really see anything all you do is fill it up put the can in the hole Assemble everything back together, apart from the lid, you've got to light it first. Now it doesn't actually produce a flame, there's a catalytic, catalytic converter in here that only requires heat to actually set it going. If you end up with a flame, you've got too much fuel in. So all you do is you heat the side of it. Supposed to keep it upright, but I find tilting it, even if it's full, you keep the flame on for about 10 seconds. That should do it. And as I say, if you fill it, fill the can full, it's good. This version is good for a good six hours. I would say more like eight hours. Possibly even longer. I'm not entirely sure that's gone. Need a bit more flame. It is easier to tilt it, even though you're not supposed to, because it gets the heat on the actual like catalytic converter too much beer so I'm have some more that's going now and it gets to the point where it's too hot to hold but what you've got is a little bag to put it in and that I'm assuming restricts oxygen flow to the catalytic converter and it produces a really quite hot certainly hotter than most conventional hand warmers with no flame and just to show you again that's you'll have to trust my word for it but that is getting to the point where it's getting too hot to hold no flame really good for the cold days that we have at, I would say the cold days that we have at the moment it seems to have turned quite warm again it must be at least seven or eight degrees C out there so there you go don't know how much they cost but I'm very impressed far better than the 
boil them up type hand warmers that you get. So you can just stick that in your pocket, go out walking, and if your hands get cold, stick it in one, one hand, then stick it in the other. Bob's your uncle. So like, comment and subscribe. We've been mm -hmm. waffling enough. It's about five minutes already. Right, cheers. See you next time. Bye.